Hey kids, welcome back to another Friday Try Day. Um, as you can see, I'm kind of by myself right now, but I won't be for long because this week we are continuing the best friends challenge that we started last week. So if you remember, I had a list of facts that were about all of us and we had to read them and try to guess who did it belong to. Some of us, we got them right, some we didn't, but this week we're gonna continue. We have more facts that we're gonna read out, so let's dive in. All right, here we go. I, mm, I saw my cat get killed by a garage door. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> well, Hi. that's so sad. You're going to cry. I See, here's the problem. I think that's you because I know you like cats. But I also think you may have owned cats. You think I like cats? <laughs> you don't like cats? Do we even know each other? We don't know each other, guys. Oh, we're not even I friends. Think, uh, All right, I have, I have who I think it is. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Michael. Matt. You guys both thought me? Yeah. I think it's Michael. All right, I I will reveal the truth. It's not me. It's, it's me! It's Mallory! <laughs> no! I knew it! I did. I had a cat growing up. Um, hated this cat so much. Yeah. He, he left me a really gnarly scar on my wrist. Oh, bummer. I know. Anyway. My dad and I were leaving to go get donuts and the cat lived in the garage and he wanted to escape but the garage door was like, I don't think so and there wasn't a sensor and he just and he died. died. Oh Aww. man. All right, next fact. Growing up, I couldn't pronounce the letter R. All right. Like. So all I, of us. I guess <laughs> I wish. At some point we all cannot pronounce I mean, when I was R. a baby, I couldn't pronounce any of my letters. True. I wish I could like, ask this person like, questions to figure out like what age are we talking about here? Like ten or like like two? Go three, two, one. Michael. Both wanted me? Oh. Because you're like well, we all could when you younger. <laughs> it makes me feel slightly worse about myself for some reason. Yeah, it would be horrible to not be able to pronounce. Right. <laughs> it was Michael. It was me. <laughs> So how it, old were you? I mean, it probably like, it was for a little bit growing up, and what was terrible is that my brother's name is Ross. Oh. So it was oh. just Wass. 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 Hey, Wass. Hey, Wass. And I wasn't a very good pirate, because every time they'd be like, <laughs> R, I'd be like, W! <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, my goodness. So I outgrew it. I was probably like, what, five or six, like, oh. doing stuff. But, like, it was, it was tough as he. Oh, yeah. that is hard, and that's that's older. Yeah, Dead. five or six. That's I was thinking like three ten. or four. Oh, okay. Ten. Oh, well, ten. Ten. <laughs> <laughs> this is the moment where we realize that we've never heard Michael say an R. He's like, oh, it's, it's still a thing. <laughs> probably. I, it, probably. Malawi <laughs> or one. Or one. Or one. Ibn. Crown instead of crayon too. Oh. Crown. Crown. And Munster. All right. Those are three facts that weren't written down. <laughs> next right. fact. Next one. Here we go. <laughs> Let's see what's up next. I rode a bull for eight seconds. Okay, I've got questions. Like a real bull or like a mechanical bull? First thought, I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. Either way, I'm impressed. I mean, it's Texas, so it could be any of us. <laughs> We all, this guy's from Ohio! We all, yeah, but until I was like 10, I mean, I'm a And then you lived in India! That's true, okay, that, that's a good I point. I have my vote. <laughs> <laughs> that's an unfair vote! Uh, three, two, one. Mal! Oh! oh look at that! We all oh. Guess, I guess Mallory, just because this feels like a fact that could really throw us off. You guess Michael, why? I guess Michael. Like I said, you're from Ohio, from you Ohio. lived in India. Bulls are Texas Well, creatures. you know, I just seem Sagging. like a man who can ride a bull. You got his belt buckle at home? <laughs> <laughs> well, clearly. He's wearing it now. <laughs> so, well, yeah, that's why. Why did I'll you destroy think? your dreams and say it was Aww. me. It was me. My, my, my I've ridden a bull and made it all the way to eight seconds. That's really impressive. Uh, yes, like a legit it is. Bull. I meant what I said. I'm very impressed. Aww. So when I was in, <laughs> when I was in Bible college, there's not a ton to do in that town. And you know, we're a bunch of good Christian kids looking for entertainment on a Friday night. And we learned that there was a church down the street. It was a cowboy church. And one of their outreach ministries was a rodeo. And so you could go and pay $10 to ride a bull. And so a bunch of us got it in our heads that we were gonna show up, pay our $10. Um, we were terribly out of place. They were 
super considerate and helpful. Basically, I think they didn't want us to die, so they were giving us all these pointers and tips. And then you got to ride a bull. You had to like sign a waiver? Yeah, like if I die, it's not your fault, kind of waiver. Um, and then we rode a bull. One of my friends did get his arm stepped on and it like swelled up. My roommate actually broke his tailbone and I had to help him around campus for like a month. <laughs> It was hilarious. Um, shout out, Chad. Anyways, so I rolled a bill for eight seconds. Love it. All right, next one. I once was in a choir show, but didn't sing at all during the performance. See, I have so many questions. Like, they just stood there like this? Or, or did they, they mouth it? Like the watermelon? You know the whole, I'm sure you know that. Yeah, like, <laughs> no. I mean, I was homeschooled, so. That's what I'm thinking. He's homeschooled. Homeschool, make him into it. All right, here we go. Three, two. One. Mallory. Mallory! We did it again! We did it again, it's just like a loop. Wait, you All said right. me? Yeah, I, oh, said I thought you. you said Mallory. No, I said Mallory. I said, just, well, I, said Ma I said you just because I know you sing. I mean, not that you don't oh. sing, but like, I know you've been <laughs> in But he's things. homeschooled. <clears throat> he, how, where, oh, where would he have man, done a choir show? That's a big point. move, Matt. So, Cause yeah. it is me! Ah! <laughs> was. I was right! I was actually, so a friend of a friend yeah. found out that I was a beatboxer and yes. they wanted to do an acapella group for the show. And so they had all the singers, oh but they goodness. needed me to be like the rhythm section. So I show up and I perform in a choir show at a school I'm not a part of. <laughs> in a choir I know no one of, because it's a friend of a friend. You just show up. I just show up and after the show everyone's like, do you go here? And I'm like, nah, and they're like, we didn't think so. <laughs> all right. I have never watched a Super Bowl game. Well, well I, I have my I guess. Made, we, we, <laughs> I have my guess too. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the downsides of Aww. Mallory and I. <laughs> we watched the Super Bowl together. <laughs> oh man, this is where me being the new guy hurts me. All right, let's vote. All right. Who's it gonna be? <laughs> Go ahead, count us down, Mallory. Ready, three, two. One. Matt! Matt. <laughs> Passive aggressive. <laughs> Matt. I have never watched, I've gone to a ton of Super Bowl parties. I have never really watched more than, I'd say, a minute to two minutes of the Super Bowl. <laughs> I've just never sat down to watch it. For me, usually, it's if there's another activity going on, I'm doing that. Um, if there's Eating people having a conversation, I'm usually in the kitchen <laughs> just like snacking away. When everybody breaks for halftime, I usually will go watch the halftime show, though. I do like to watch those. I love to watch sports live. I'm just not a person who can really engage with sports on a television, but I'll always go to someone's house to watch any kind of sport because I like being around friends. Yeah. But I rarely look at the television. Do you like the commercials? The Super Bowl's got some of the best I commercials. will do that at the Super Bowl. I will go back like on YouTube the next day and watch all the commercials. <laughs> That's some good ones. Cut out all the football. Yeah, cut out all the football. <laughs> Please, no football. Get those commercials, I'm in. All right. All right, right. Next, next, fact. One. next one. Next one. Too. All right. I sold knives while in college. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. This sounds like a me story. It does. That's it, what this I'm sounds thinking. like a story. It sounds like Matt. He sold so many things when he was. A, he sold. I sold makeup. I made cakes. I sold used books. Like anything very I could do to I make. Did. It was a lot of girly things. This isn't very girly though. No, it's this not. This is kind of like your way to make up for all the girly nonsense. <laughs> I just, days. I get why you guys might think it's me. I'm just making a case to say this sounds like me because I did a lot of random yeah. sales things in college mm -hmm. to make money. Mm -hmm. But I have my vote. I have my I vote. I have my vote too. I have my vote. All right, count us down. Here we go. Three, two, one. Mike. Mallory. All right, it wasn't me. It was it's not me. Mallory. It was, it was you for real? It was. Nice. So, actually never got to the point where I sold them. <laughs> it was a pyramid scheme, okay? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I sold knives in college. I never actually <laughs> sold any knives. So you're just a bad salesman. Here's what happened, okay? So it was one of those things where somebody was like, hey, come and do this for this company. So I went, I did some training. They taught me how, like what to say and all of this stuff. And then I go, this sounds fishy, so I'm not going to do this. So I bounced. Okay. Well, I'm glad you got out before you lost a bunch of money in knives. Did you keep the original no, knife set? They never gave me a knife mm. set. But they were kind of cool. I learned how to cut a penny with, the scissors, with, with, with a scissors and made it into a rose. I've always wanted... Oh, for real? Yeah. I don't know if I can still do it. That's but awesome. But I learned. 
Okay, okay. That's great. I'm happy for you. Well, that was so much fun. We got to learn a lot more about one another. Uh, super fun. Thanks for joining us today. Make sure that you tune in for this Sunday's Sunday service video. It's going to be awesome. We're concluding our series on the Bible. It's going to be great. So until then, see you guys. <laughs> and see, if you'd ever stood next to me in worship, you would have known good and well. <laughs> I'm not a great singer. My wife says I'm a great worshiper, uh, but not a great singer. I know what that means. Yeah. <laughs> when someone says, oh, you're God such a great worshiper, worship. God loves your worship, that's like the Southern bless their heart. Yeah. It totally means you're a terrible a singer. Backhanded. Jehoshaphat yeah. would have put you in the front. Yes, <laughs> would. Lead them in a victory. Uh, if you don't worship. get it, read the Bible. <laughs>